Shake, shook, shaken, shaking. Infinite form to shake. Verb form shake. Noun form shake. Third person present singular shakes. Past tense shook. Present participle or gerund shaking. Past participle shaken. The opposing teams had to shake hands after the match. Her body started to shake in fear. Western businessmen shake hands when they meet. The machine will stir and shake the ice cream and milk to make a milkshake. Her body shakes in anticipation of the ride. The building shook during the earthquake. Both teams shook hands after the match. Her mother shook the liquid medicine before pouring it. The news left her shaken to the core. James Bond likes his drinks shaken, not stirred. The practice of shaking hands is a Western tradition. Shaking with anticipation, the girl stepped into the roller coaster. You cannot shake hands with a clenched fist, Indira Gandhi. The best feeling in the world is a hard workout, a shower, and a protein shake. Micro Crow Cop. Making money is certainly the one addiction I cannot shake. Felix Dennis. My demons are not that easy to shake. Jesse Reyes. Defeat may serve as well as victory to shake the soul and let the glory out. Edwin Markham. Boxing is the only sport you can get your brain shook, your money took, and your name in the Undertaker book. Joe Frazier. Painting calmed the chaos that shook my soul. Nikki de saint Philae. I shook up the world. I shook up the world. Muhammad Ali. Truth like a torch. The more it's shook, it shines. William Hamilton. I was asleep at the wheel before cancer shook me awake. Chris Carr. Without craftsmanship, inspiration is a mere reed shaken in the wind. John Johannes Brahms. Johannes Brahms. Sorry with the names. Probably not pronouncing them right. I have seen whole countries shaken by the power of God. Reinhard Bonke. In any civil in any so civil society. There's a serious problem when confidence in the rule of law is shaken. Margaret Hoover. In any civil society, there's a serious problem when confidence in the rule of law is shaken. In my attempt to defend myself, I was badly injured on my left hand. I am shaken, but fortunate to be alive. Petra Kivtova. Sometimes you need to be shaken out of a situation. Lisa Jewell. It's tough campaigning. It's tough campaigning, kissing hands and shaking babies. Pat Paulson. And the reason why that quote is famous is because it should be shaking hands and kissing babies, not the opposite. In case you were wondering. If the boat started shaking, we stayed on course and didn't lose focus. That made the difference. Sebastian Vessel. 3D. 3D printing is already shaking our age-old notions of what can and can't be made. Hood Lipson. Jesus is much more concerned about shaking your foundations, giving you an utterly alternative self-image, world image, and God image, and thus reframing your entire reality. Mere inspiration can never do this. Richard Rohr. God has ways of shaking the world when he is at, his, at work. He literally caused the ground to quake when Jesus died on the cross. Charles Stanley. Irregular verbs that have the same pattern as shake, shook, shaken, shaking. Forsook, for, forsake, forsook, forsaken, forsaking. Mistake, mistook, mistaken, mistaking. Overtake, overtook, overtaken, overtaking. Take, took, taken, taking. Undertake, undertook, undertaken, undertaking. Thank you for visiting.
please like, subscribe, and comment. Feel free to ask any questions or suggest future topics in the comments. If you like Christian poetry, check out my other channel, Narrowgate vs. Scandalgate, on YouTube and many other streaming platforms. You can find my Christian poetry or fantasy books at Amazon.com under LDDJ. My website is otakusforotakus.com. Have an incredible day. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. For God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. He who believes in him is not condemned, but he who does not believe is condemned already, because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God.